fall fruits and vegetables are in season and that means it's a perfect time to treat your baby to homemade, creamy, sweet, bright orange baby food. So to start on this butternut squash, apple, sweet potato, whew, three things in there, it's gonna be a, quite a delicious meal. Uh, I'm gonna start with the butternut squash and what I like to do is just peel it. I know that this looks incredibly intimidating. Uh, when I first saw a butternut squash years and years and years ago, I'm sure that I would have that same feeling of like, I don't know what to do with that, I can't cut that, but it's really easy and it's also totally worth it because butternut squash is packed with vitamin A and C which is great for your baby and great for you. So that's all you have to do is peel it like that and just cut off the top right there. Ugh, you wanna get your muscles into it and look at that. It looks like it's a little white on there, but very orange and gorgeous there. And for this recipe, all we're gonna be doing with our, uh, with our apple and our sweet potato and our butternut squash are cutting them into chunks. So just see like this, that you wanna get your pieces. It doesn't have to be too small because we're gonna be roasting them just like this, there you go, just so you can see. Little cubes, squares, and this is our finished product. I cooked this in a 425 degree oven for anywhere from 45 to 55 minutes, just depending on the size that you cut them. And you're gonna ask, why are you roasting for baby food? Of course, baby food is amazing when it's roasted because when you roast, you're getting that like caramel, flavor, color, like you're adding, you're intensifying the flavor of the fruits and vegetables. Um, you know, because sometimes when you steam, it's just not always as exciting. So this is sort of like homemade baby food at its best in the fall. So what I'm doing is I'm putting some of the sweet potato, butternut squash, and apple in my baby bullet. But I like to make a huge sheet tray of this because you can eat this for your dinner, serve these beautiful chunks of roast apple, sweet potato, and butternut squash, and then you have a perfect size portion here for your baby. And what I'm gonna add also is some pumpkin pie spice. It's got cinnamon, nutmeg, allspice, all these just delicious fall flavors. Uh, so you can sit and watch your baby light up at the first taste of these flavors. So I've got about a quarter teaspoon there. And you can start pureeing it. You may need a little bit of hot water, breast milk, milk, I mean like rice milk or almond milk if you wanted. Um, oh. Yeah, you can see it's already a little bit thick, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of water to loosen it up a bit. And that's it, that's all you have to do. And look at this beautiful, sweet and creamy puree. And then I like to take one of my favorite accessories from the Baby Bullet and just put it into these freezer trays. And they're amazing, I'm actually making this for a friend's um, grandson who was just born. And this way I can deliver her this beautiful puree and she can um, take it to her grandson's house, pop it into zipper bags put the label so you know that they'll last for three months and then just any time you want some food for your baby, those fall delicious flavors, all you have to do is pop out one of these butternut squash, apple, sweet potato cubes, let it defrost, and you have this delicious puree that you know your baby's gonna love. For more fast, fresh, and easy recipes like this and more, check out Wheelicious.com.